So here I am at the Yangjiang Hotel in Nanning, China, and they have a thing called a Brazilian barbecue here. Miranda, my daughter, and I decided to come here tonight. What it is for 108 RMB, if you're a member, 108 RMB, all you gotta do is give them your, your phone number, but I come here so often, they don't even use my phone number, they just, they just know me. So I, I pay 108 RMB per person, and it's all you can eat and all you can drink Brazilian barbecue. And they've got this wine here, like, it's it's like 85 bucks a bottle or RMB a bottle. But I can I can go through a couple of bottles in an evening easy because I'm going out 60. So uh, tonight I'm going to be drinking wine. Actually, Randy found a Belgian raspberry beer up here that's really good. And uh, we're going to be drinking beer and wine tonight. And we're going to be eating barbecue and uh, whatever. So uh, stay tuned. I'll be right back. So I need to show you some of the things that, that they've got here because uh, you won't believe this. It is like 20 bucks Canadian, I think. So over in this area over here, they've got uh, Beijing duck. I don't see the duck yet. It's still a little bit early. And, you, and you've got um, egg tarts and french fries. You've got... I don't know what that is. Jinjiao maybe? Just a second, I'll turn the camera on. And you got fish. Oh yeah, oh yeah. Back in this area, this is where they do all of the barbecuing. Of, of, uh, and you see the skewers on the back there? And they go round and round, and then they bring them out and they cut them off and stuff like that. And it's it's like scrump delicious. They got one here that's a roast beef that is, oh, it's so good and so tender. It, uh, it needs a little bit of salt, but hey, you know, a little bit of salt is nothing. They've got, they've got innards, they've got chicken legs, they've got uh, roast pork, they've got roast beef. They used to have camel here every once in a while. I think in the winter time they still do. But uh, they've got uh, fish, they've got, you, basically you, 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 uh, you think of it, and they've got it here. Then, they, then they've got a sushi bar, and, and they make sushi here for, for the people. And he's just in the midst of making it because we just opened here and uh, people come and they got it all and now they're making more. Don't forget the treats, the cakes and the puddings and stuff like that. You need puddings and you need fruit because after you eat, you need fruit. And they've got that too. And then you've got the salads, and you've got the snails, you've got uh, the, the veggies, and the tofus, and all of those things that, uh, yeah, they've, they've got it all. Then they've got, they actually even have caramel corn here, they've got fountain drinks, they've got juice, they've got pop. Hello, Hello how are you? I'm blessed, thank you. Good, good, good. And, and then they've got uh, peas and and they've got the beers here. And these are all these are all really good beers. Then they've got other little teas and stuff. Then they've got more treats. And then they've got a cooler full of coolers. And uh, it's all free for 108 RMB. You can come in here for between five o'clock at night and nine o'clock. Nine? Yeah, seven. Yeah, nine o'clock at night. And uh, so you're here for four hours and you can eat and drink anything you want. So uh, that's exactly what Miranda and I are doing tonight is we're in here eating and drinking everything we want. And that's just the way it is. And this is my friend. You know. And I come here a lot so they, they know who I am. But uh, it's quiet, it's nice. Uh, it's heated in the wintertime and cooled in the summertime. So uh, let's go. Uh, let's go eat some food and get some of these uh, these skewers on our table. I'm hungry like a bitch wolf. I really am. But I don't have no fish balls because I know fish don't have balls. So Miranda, what do you got there? Um, noodles. Noodles, broccoli. Bacon. Bacon? Is it really? And, and fatty pork. Yeah, and whatever this is. And whatever that is. Yeah, I don't know. You know you should speak up so people can hear you. Yeah. Is it good? It's a plum, eh? Yeah, it's a plum. A white plum. 
，要我跑？垫垫啊！一点点。好的。好、啊，谢谢。Some of their meat isn't uh, is is still bloody in the middle, but you know it's got some pretty good taste to it. Mm. But bloody's up my plate. But I'm a meat eater, and it really goes good with my red wine, red meat. So uh, so be it. <laughs> This is one of the best places I've ever come to in anywhere in China for, for food. It's a reasonable cost and uh, the food is excellent. Very tasty. And the wine is good too. So she gets up and she goes and gets caramel corn. Really? Caramel corn? Really? Why not? You're at a Brazilian barbecue and you get caramel corn? Where's the meat? Because there's a lot of people in the restaurant today. Uh, it takes them a lot longer to come around with the meat. So uh, you just have to be patient there, Randy, and not eat so much caramel corn. You know what I mean? Drink some more beer. Have some wine. Let loose. We still. How many, how many kilometers did we? How many kilometers did we walk today? Uh, fourteen and a half. Fourteen and a half kilometers. So we deserve as much wine and meat as we can eat and drink, or drink and eat. How does that work? It is what it is. Oh, and uh, this guy next to us over here. He was. He got up to get his food, and uh, some some young guys sat down in his place. He was not happy, and uh, we watched it. And I told Miranda, I said, uh, the old guy wins 100% of the time, and uh, the old guy sit there, and yes, he won. So it's his seat. Is that roast beef? No, that's not roast beef. Oh, okay. One of the main reasons I, I come to the Brazilian barbecue is for their their roast beef. It's tender. It's 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 most excellent. It's, it's the same as roast beef at home in Canada. I'm finding Western food that tastes the same here as in Canada is really hard to find. I don't just come for the wine, guys. I come for the meat. Life is tough. I know. 20 bucks Canadian. All you can eat and all you can drink. Brazilian barbecue. 
fuck out of here. Like, seriously? 20 bucks. For 20 bucks in Canada, what are you going to get? A bowl of frickin' soup? Then you got to tip them. Here, there's no tipping. Oh, give, give it, give it a go. A lega. Lenga. 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 She seen me. I know he with your fingers. He's impolite in China, but these chicken legs are actually chicken wings, but the drumstick part of the chicken wings. They're spicy, they're good. I like it. Mm. Oh baby. Mm. Oh. This Brazilian barbecue is to die for. Seriously, it is. And that, my friends, is another video from Guilau 60 at the Yongjiang Hotel in Nanning, Guangxi Autonomous Region, China. If you like this video, as always, like, comment, subscribe. Push that share button. Don't forget to resubscribe. And uh, whatever you do, don't forget to peace out. I love this place. This is one of my favorite places, and these are some of my favorite people. Say hello. Hello. <laughs> Gotta love it, eh? Pretty girls, good kids, and uh, a good atmosphere. This is Nanning China, signing off for tonight. Good night.